Hi, welcome to the Dreaming of Echoes Homestead. Today I picked up a bunch of grapes, so I made some grape juice and started grape vinegar. All the things I need to know learning how to be a homesteader. You guys have a blessed day. All right. Excuse my messy sink. This is real life living. All right. Remember the grapes I told you I was turning into vinegar. I am straining it now and I am using a coffee filter because there was a little bit, not much, but a little bit of mold on the top. But you scrape that off. And so I'm filtering it all out. I cleaned this jar. I sanitized it and then I sterilized it again with plain white vinegar to make sure that there is no bacteria in this jar. All right. You guys have a blessed day. See you next time. All right. Today is... February the 6th or 7th? February the 6th. Today is February the 6th, 2023. The dishwasher is going in the background and my glasses are in a desperate need of being cleaned. Today I am bottling up the vinegar that I made in early December with some globe grapes. If you remember, I had two jars. I've already taken the SCOBY out and put it in a Ziploc bag and put it in another container. And I stuck it in the freezer for use on another vinegar that I'll probably do this summer. But I'm going to taste this vinegar. It smells, smells like vinegar. I'm going to give it a taste. Let's see if it tastes like vinegar on camera. You can see, if you look right here, you can see where the scoby, I pushed it off the edge before removing it and putting it in the freezer. There we go. Yep. That's definitely vinegar. I think if this had been sealed, it probably would have made a very good wine. Hmm. I accidentally made um, pomegranate wine last year. But I need the vinegar more than I need the wine. You guys have a blessed day. Thank you for watching Dreaming of an Eccles Homestead and this vinegar adventure. Thank you for visiting Dreaming of an Eccles Homestead. Please like, subscribe, and hit that bell, and leave a comment. Have a blessed day.